Hey guys, I'm Lily here with Mom Bear Reviews and today we are talking about some summer must-haves, whether you have a kid on swim team, whether you are going to the beach, taking a spring big vacation, poolside, what have you. Here are some of my must-haves besides your normal swimsuit and towel and sunscreen. So if that's something you want to see, let's get into it. Okay, so first we're going to start off with stuff that isn't going to break the bank. I am all for having supplies that are needed to make life easier without costing a fortune. Um, I know there's a very popular swim bag um, called the bog bag that is going around. Everyone has one, but for me, it was just expensive and I was not about to spend a hundred plus dollars on a swim bag. So I found a dupe. This is a bog bag dupe. I got it on Sam's Club. They still have them this season. So definitely go check out your local Sam's Club or online. Um, or if you don't have a Sam's Club membership, find someone that does and see if you can go with them. This was 50 bucks on from Sam's Club, which is still kind of expensive. I know they have cheaper options um, on Amazon, but this one is actual high quality. I used it all summer. It's going to be my swim bag this summer. It held up great and it holds so much stuff. Like I still have it packed from last summer. I haven't even taken anything out of it and it is very durable. The only difference I can see between this bag and the bog bag are the slits. So these are kind of like slitted holes instead of like the circle ones. So if you were going to buy any of the bog bag accessories, you're not going to be able to fit it. I tried it. It doesn't work. Anyways, so it does spin up and it'll stay up. It is sturdy. Um, you can slide these down if you want to be in it all the time. Anyways, highly, highly recommend this, this bag. They have a different colors or you can totally just buy the bog bag if that's your preference. But anyways, sturdy swim bag. Now let's get into the goodies inside. So um, the first thing that I deemed as a must have for the summer is a first aid kit. Yes, if you're going to a swimming pool, public, or a swim club you belong to, they should have a first aid kit there. However, I found this super handy to have um, if you want an in-depth of what's in it, because I don't have your traditional like gauze and stuff. I made my own. I will link that reel I did down below. You can go check it out. It gives a more detailed view of what's in this, but basically I put together my own little first aid kit. It has Neosporin, it has antiseptic spray, wet wipes, band-aids, um, like mosquito sucker thing that like sucks out the itchiness for bug bites. Um, it has bee sting stuff, it has Motrin, Tylenol, thermometer, it has um, band-aids, insect repellent, mosquito patches, all that. So, so I'm gonna go check out this reel to see a more in-depth of what's in it but you can create your own i got this at target and all the stuff i got on amazon and target and i will link everything i talk about below that is the first thing in the swim bag the next things are these mister fans the kids love these fill this with water it spins it sprays it mists definitely beneficial to keep cool this summer i have extra swimsuits like i said i have not unpacked this since last summer um the main the popular one that i shared last summer that everyone went crazy for are these fans they are small but mighty super powerful it comes with the lanyard this one's my husband he put a sticker on it um because we all have one i have a white one in here somewhere oh right here they have a ton of different colors these things i anytime i was using them i had so many people stop me last summer and were like where did you get those because it was so powerful and handheld, like it's smaller than my phone. Um, so I got these on Amazon, super great, great quality, lasts all summer, they're rechargeable. I love those. Um, a good swim goggles, if your kids does swim team or if you just swim a lot. I also, I also have these bags that I snagged off Amazon that has all the swim caps, extra goggles, all that stuff in this bag and it fits perfectly in here to just store all the stuff. Speaking of stuff, like I have a few of these. Speaking of stuff, my F fell off, but I also have a bag of just miscellaneous items. Hairbrush, gum, deodorant. I have some liquid IVs in here if you're spending 
all day out in the sun, great for hydration. Lotion, hair ties, hand sanitizer, um, tampons for the ladies, you never know. Wet wipes, let me tell you, you might not be a fan of wet wipes, but they're a necessity for summer because if have you ever tried to wipe your kid, maybe they have to go number two. And that is the worst to try and clean up when they are wet, the suit is wet, everything's wet, and you try and take dry, dry toilet paper and clean them. No, nope, it's a hot mess. Get you some wet wipes. They have travel ones for like 99 cents at Target. Go snag some. Thank me later. Um, yeah, so that's all like random miscellaneous stuff in here. I do have one for snacks. It's empty. I haven't refilled it. But I do have like, I'll put granola bars and stuff that doesn't really need to be refrigerated. But we'll talk more about snacks later. I have another pack. Um, I also have an empty one for wetsuits. If we are changing to go somewhere right after, keep your wetsuits in here and not get everything wet. Um, my Target swim cover, I am obsessed with. I pretty much lived in this last summer. Super cute on Amazon. It just throws over your swimsuit. And these foldable sun hats I found on Amazon. It has no top, so if you're wearing a top knot like this, the hat fits right over it. You can still keep your mom bun going strong, and it folds right up. Super, super fun. Um, I also got these. I found a target. I haven't even opened them. haven't used them yet. But these fans go around your neck. So if you have a kid on swim team, you understand. Your life is pretty much outside and at the pool. And I'm super excited to try these for swim champs. When you are outside in like 100 plus degree weather from 6 a.m. to like 5 p.m., I'm excited to try those this summer. I have obviously some sunscreen, hair clips, a portable Bluetooth speaker. Um, and yeah, so that's pretty much, like I said, extra fans. That's pretty much what I have in this bag. So all that stuff fits in here plus room for the towels. Obviously when it's a little more organized, all this stuff fits in here nicely because I keep it organized with these bags because nothing is worse than trying to find a chapstick in a bag in a bag full of stuff. So what I also will say is a necessity is a phone charger. This specific one plugs right into your phone. It'll tell you what the percentage is at. Mine says 100 right now because it is fully charged. It is rechargeable, plugs right in the bottom of your phone and you are good to go, especially if you were gonna be outside by the beach or the pool all day with no plugs to phone charge, definitely this is the iWalk brand. They have a ton of different colors. They even have some that have bedazzled. I highly recommend. That is a must in a swim bag. Um, my next product, I've already done a review on, but I want to mention something for your house. It is getting warmer. So I don't know about you, but the bugs are out. This catchy um, fly and bug catcher has been a lifesaver for our house. I have a full review on it. I will link below. Um, it basically UV lights, they get attracted to it and then they come in and get sucked up into it. Like you can see all the gnats and nastiness that's already been sucked up this summer, um, or this spring. So definitely recommend one of these. Check it out. I have a full review on this. I will link somewhere and you can go check it out. Now on to my new purchase of this season. Um, besides new swimsuits and goggles and caps and stuff, that's all that's all you know, obvious. This thing I've gotten so many questions about, I've gotten stopped and so many people love this. It is a Snapple box. I got this on Amazon. It's really popular on social media right now, but this Snapple box, this is leftover from last night's swim, um, last night's swim practice. So it's kind of dirty, but, um, this thing is amazing. Um, it has handles, you can carry it. It snaps shut. Super easy to clean. It all can be washed. The lid comes off. These little compartments come out. So even if you have multiple kids, you can kind of dole out these individual things. I just set this on the table or bench or wherever we're at and they come through and just kind of pick their favorite snacks and go about their day. Um, when it gets to be swim season, I will probably cut up fruits and vegetables. You can stick it in the fridge the night before, pull it out when it's time to go. I am obsessed with this thing. So many people have stopped me and they're like, that's the greatest idea. It has saved me so much money at the snack bar. My kids loved the snack bar last year and it cost a fortune. 
even though the things are only a dollar or two, you know, they want six or seven things. This has definitely been the best purchase for this summer so far. So I'm super excited because the kids love it. Plus it's just so cute. You have this and your swim bag and ice chest. Um, I don't have the ice chest out, but we do love our Yeti 18 can, just normal ice chest. Super easy, holds a ton of stuff. It will last all swim meet um, or all day at the pool with different cold snacks or drinks or whatever. So that is a must have too, but obviously get the ice chest of your choice. I will link the snackle box because I have a feeling that will be the most popular thing I talk about. So comment down below what your favorite item um, from this haul was. And if you have any other video requests, drop them down below. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in the next video.